Hello everyone and welcome to Turn 1 Soul Ring. It's time to hail the greatest Elder Dragon of all time and you know who it is. This is So You're Building for Nico Bolas. I've put together some pieces for an EDH deck that is thematically bolus in every way it can be. This is mainly a fun deck to throw together and join a casual game with your friends. This is the deck that everyone ignores and leaves for last so that they can get the easy win. Good. Just as the god pharaoh planned, let them fall into your traps and make them behold your glory as you lord over them once and for all. So to do this, you'll need some creatures. We have the original Bolas as our commander, so let's bring in Nico Bolas the Ravager, who flips into a nice planeswalker. Nico Bolas the Arisen. This walker is definitely something we want to get out as soon as possible, because card draw and good removal on one permanent is always nice to use and makes people waste their removal on. Other creatures to consider are the Locust God, because he goes well with the card draw Risen gives us, the Scarab God, because stealing things from graveyards is essentially what Bolas did to Amonkhet, the Scorpion God, because minus one, minus one counters are really hard to get rid of, and Disciple of Bolas, because card draw and life gain are beautiful things. Planeswalkers are going to be a big part of this deck. We'll be running every Bolas Walker we can, so the original Nico Bolas Planeswalker is excellent for this deck, giving us removal, thievery, and an explosive ultimate. Nico Bolas God Pharaoh just gives us a whole bunch of great options and opens this deck up in a huge way. Nico Bolas the Deceiver isn't as good as the other three, but he does give us some nice options, and Liliana Vess, who gives us a tutor and hand attack. In terms of artifacts, a great one to consider is Visage of Bolas, giving us a mana rock and tutoring for one of our Bolas Planeswalkers. Definitely a good card for this deck. In order to flesh out this deck, let's look at sorceries and instants. Dark Intimations gives us removal and a recursion for our walkers. Not only that, but it gives one of our Bolas Planeswalkers an additional loyalty counter. Cruel Ultimatum isn't as good, but it's still a great card for this deck, giving us card draw, life gain, and recursion while simultaneously hurting an opponent really, really bad. Hour of Devastation is a field wipe that is perfectly crafted for this deck, and Croesus's Charm, giving us a Bounce Spell, Removal, and Artifact Destruction, are good ways of getting rid of things we don't like. As foretold is a great way of cheating our boluses out. As each turn progresses and the counters increase on it more and more, it tells of the coming of the god Pharaoh. Your opponents will get more and more nervous as they know their end is near. Welcome your god pharaoh with open arms and he will vanquish your enemies. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed the video, give it a like and subscribe down below if you want to help support the channel. Make sure to hit that bell so you know when the next Turn 1 Soul Ring video is uploaded. And as always everyone, have a great one.